Welcome to Mojo Plays, and today we're taking a look at 10 of the dumbest, most absurd, and funniest ways to die in Helldivers 2. Before we begin, we publish new videos all week long, so be sure to subscribe to Mojo Plays and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos. Friendly Fire! Friendly Fire is both a blessing and a curse. If one of your buddies is being annoying, taking them down is a good way to put them back in their place, or maybe even open you up to some salty revenge. In Helldivers, it can be both. However, when it's time to get serious, you can still easily get your teammates killed if anyone strays directly into your line of fire. If you're not paying attention to where everyone is, don't be surprised if your fit of panic causes you to eat your friend's bullets. Sentry Fire It isn't just your friend's bullets you have to worry about. Some of the stratagems you can unlock will let you summon turrets. These can be exceptionally helpful when placed in the right spots and give you some additional firepower if you find yourself overrun by bugs or robots. But remember, Helldiver's claim to infamy is the friendly fire. This applies to turrets as well. Should you stand in front of a target the turret is aiming at? Well, prepare to be peppered. Peppering Mines Speaking of pepper, one of the best and funniest stratagems to use is the anti-personal minefield, or as I like to call it, the pepper spray. Once deployed, this machine sprays mines in a wide, wide radius. Problem is that these mines are so small and blend into most environments so well that it can be easy for you and your teammates to run right into one of them if you aren't paying close attention. What's even more hilarious is when someone forgets you deployed mines and blows themselves up on their way to extraction. If you use one of these pepper sprays, don't be surprised if you get yelled at later. Respawns. Allied destroyer joining squadron, deploying Helldiver to combat zone. We are no strangers to spawn fragging. Back in the days of Quake, dying because someone spawned on your position was a rare but hilarious occurrence. In Helldivers 2, you need to watch where you're choosing players to respawn. Your troll of a friend might get the bright idea to land right on top of you. And sure enough, getting smashed on the head with a Hellpod will kill you. In other words, spawn fragging is back and with more intent and possibility than it ever did before. Request approved. Reinforcements have been launched. to the enemy. Extraction ships. You have been a stolen line of freedom. Welcome one for Brockton and Barton. Got a launch in 20 seconds. Normally, games just shove you out of the way when vehicles or objects are on a fixed path and need to reach a certain point you're blocking. Helldivers 2, as we've seen already, is not like most games. When you have waited two minutes for extraction to begin, you better watch your position. Getting caught under the hull or wings of the extraction ship will kill you. And if everyone has already boarded, then you will be left behind and labeled as failed to extract. Countdown initiated. Stand by for takeoff. Extraction complete. Falcon 1 beginning ascent. Going Max Payne. One mechanic that can occasionally come in handy is the ability to go prone. While this doesn't really give you room to use stealth, it can let you escape from a charging enemy. 
just one problem. This mechanic can bite you in the ass. If you go prone while running, you will leap into the air and land on your front or backside. And if you manage to leap off of a certain height, you will take fall damage and go into a ragdoll state. What are the chances of you dying from fall damage? Well, they, they are low, given there aren't too many heights to climb and jump from. But if you're at low enough health and you do die from leaping off of a rock, you have no one to blame but yourself. Swimming! Now, we don't expect every game in the universe to let you swim. However, this is just ridiculous. In one of our missions, we explored one of the many icy areas of the arctic wasteland of a planet, Heath. We stumbled upon a small pond, to me, that seemed swimmable. It took no more than 10 seconds for my guy to drown. Yes, swimming for even a fraction of a minute can get you killed. What the hell, man? A badly placed orbital strike. Orbital strikes can really come in handy when clearing nests in one move. Thing is that not every one of them is created equally. Some are pretty good about concentrating their firepower where you've thrown your beacon, others, not so much. Some orbital strikes, like the Orbital 120mm HE Barrage, will shoot around the beacon rather than the center. Or, they will shoot at the center and just choose some random spots within a certain radius to bombard you with. In other words, you're going to want to chuck this beacon as far away from you as possible, regardless of what orbital strike you have coming your way. Just don't chance it. Forgetting to reload. Another facet of Helldivers 2 that makes it harder than most shooters is how you reload your weapon. It is important that you remember to manually reload and make use out of every single bullet you have. Should you reload while bullets are still in your clip, well, say goodbye to those remaining bullets. They gone. Just imagine the loads of people who blasted through their ammunition during their first or second mission and forgot to call in resupply. Yeah, there are most likely some people out there who really don't want to admit that, but we know you're out there. We know. Hell Dive Difficulty. In order to unlock missions at the hardest difficulty, you will have to play and beat missions on the hardest difficulty available. So, you will start at easy, then you'll go to medium, which will unlock challenging, which will unlock hard, then extreme, suicide, impossible, and finally, hell dive. Under this difficulty, enemies are armored to the core. Enemies are bigger and hit harder, and you'll be making frequent visits to death's door. If you think you can just waltz in with any gun and loadout you feel comfortable with, you got another thing coming. Stock up, get the best stuff available. What's the dumbest way you've died in Helldivers 2? Did it make our list? Share your stories with us down in the comments below, and be sure to subscribe to Mojo Plays for more great videos every day. All in the name of democracy! Did you enjoy this video? Check out some of our other videos here on Mojo Plays, and don't forget to subscribe for more awesome content every day.